Welcome back to the session on LaTeX. In this session, we will learn to create tables, align its content and adjust the column width. One can create a table using the tabular environment as shown here. The syntax is slash begin tabular and we mention the alignment of each column. Each cell is separated by ampersand and the end of the row is denoted by two backslashes. This is an example of a basic table which has three columns and three rows. Let's look at the commands. The tabular environment begins which is followed by the alignment of the columns. C represents center which is the first column, L represents left for the second column and R right for the third column. We then start writing our content, number in the first cell, ampersand to take a new cell, item, ampersand, price and slash slash for the new row. Let us see a demo. I already have the commands for the table written here which successfully creates a table, number, item, price which we just saw in the slides. Now let us add another row. 3 ampersand to switch to the next cell. Let us write writing pad ampersand for the price cell and let us have an expensive one. So, we set the price as 1540. New line, let us build and run. There you go. This is how we add rows. Now, let us add a column called quantity, ampersand QTY, say we have the quantity as 2, for pencil we have the quantity as 3 and for writing pad we have the quantity as 1 and we decide the alignment to be left for the fourth column. Let us build and run, there you go. So, now our table has four columns. Let us switch back to our slides. Now, to adjust the column width, instead of mentioning the alignment, we write P and the size of the column in curly brace. In this example, the first column is of 1 centimeter, second column is of 3 centimeters and the third column is of 2 centimeter. Let us see a demo. Let us adjust the size of the second column. We come here. And instead of L, we write P curly bracket open and close and we write 4 centimeter. Let us build and run. As you can see, the second column is of 4 centimeters now. Rest of the content remains same. So, in this session, we learnt to create a basic table, align its content of the column and specify the column width. Let me ask you a question. We indeed did write LaTeX commands to create a table, but did you get a feel of a table while viewing it? I guess the answer is no. And why is that so? Let us explore this in the next session. Thank you. Have a nice day.